Hey there, good evening and thank you for watching my uh, YouTube videos. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a short video on Microsoft um, PowerPoint and lists and changing the list um, numbering sequence. And this will be very quick. For example, say you are creating a list of things to buy or any list for that matter, uh, you can present this. And you have numbers one through six here, and you're going to then you want to duplicate it, okay? And now we have the same list over twice, but you want the numbering to continue. So you want one, two, three, four, five, six, and you want this to be seven, eight, nine, ten. So the question is, how do we do that? So we have our list of things to buy, and we continue with some different things. And this goes one through six. So now I want this to start at 7. And how do we do that? Well, it's quite simple. This is very simple, very quick. I'm going to show you. What I'm going to do is I'm just simply going to select the first one here. All right. I'm going to go up here to the uh, numbering. And I'm going to go over and select bullets and numbering. It's going to ask me um, where I want to start with. Well, I'm going to start at number 7, right? Because we ended at 6 over there and we want to start with 7. So as we go up to 7, it'll start 7, and then subsequently 8, 9, and 10. Okay, so now when we go to our presentation, we have a list of things to buy. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And that is my quick tutorial on one function within Microsoft PowerPoint uh, 2013. Um, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Anything you'd like to see, uh, tips and tricks, let me know. Again, thanks a lot.